Good morning, happy Monday everybody. It is Sunday for me and it is day one. So it's August 13th, day one of my potato reset. Not that I've stopped eating potatoes. I've eaten potatoes every day for the past six months. February, March, April, May, June, July, August. Yeah, six months, seven months, almost seven months by the end of this month. Um, but you know, those that have been following me know that I've kind of widened my range of food to other whole plant foods and lately i've been not eating as well as i could be i guess i'm not eating horribly but i feel like a little off track so i don't want to be the old me that gets completely off track and don't realize i'm off track until three months later and i've gained like 10 pounds or something like that <laughs> and feel like crap, so I'm not playing that game anymore. So now when I notice I'm getting a little off track, I do something about it, so that's what I'm gonna do. For the first few days, maybe a little longer, I'm gonna be eating potatoes only with sauces, so no vegetables, just potatoes. Um, very minimal sauces, minimal salt, just to really reset my taste buds. I'm gonna be doing that for the next few days, and if you guys wanna follow along and join me, and if you want information on what you can eat, uh, download my free PDF guide. I forgot to tell you guys about that. I'm sorry. I worked so hard on it and I forgot to tell you guys. So uh, go to thepotatoreset.com and enter your email address so I can send you the link to the download and that's that. All right, so this is a rough idea of how much I'll eat today. Maybe I should weigh this and see if I guessed right. Probably a little more, a little over four pounds. 4.6. 4.6, let's see. All right, so I don't have a fancy kitchen scale. 2.2. All right, so 6.8 and this bowl weighs 2.2. They don't call me potato queen for nothing. I guessed exactly 4.6 and guess what? They're 4.6. I got it exactly right. potatoes right there I've got baked potatoes and fries and I got the oven at 420 Fahrenheit there we go. Ta -da. we'll come back in about 40 minutes it wet first so you don't get too hot oh, oh boy that's cold water oh, Bug, hey, 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 stop it. Come on. Hey, that's enough. Chill out. Hey, June bug, come on. Yeah, she's getting pissed off. You stop it. Got my trusty stone ground West Bray Naturals no salt added mustard. And I'm gonna give this stuff a try because I haven't tried it yet. A sodium free one. See how it tastes. Hmm. It does taste a little salty. Very weird. Potassium chloride. I don't really know what that is. I ate everything except for two. I'm full. I can't eat anymore. If I ate these two, I would just, my stomach would hurt. So, <clears throat> stop it. being super lazy. I just, I have stuff I gotta do, but I don't wanna do it. I could take a nap, but I'm not a napper. I don't know. I think um, I'm missing my tea. And I don't think it has a ton of caffeine in it, but it does have some. I'm craving a little bit. Things are popping in my head, like, hmm, a banana spinach smoothie smell sounds really good right now. This actually feels kind of harder than it was the first time but I think that maybe I've forgotten how hard it was the first time
down to the last couple of bites, I'm getting full. I didn't actually make the rest of the potatoes that I had. There's two potatoes left after all that, and uh, I guess that would be the extra half a pound of potatoes that I normally don't eat. I've got sparkling water, lime flavor, there's no artificial sweeteners or no sweeteners at all. It's just fizzy water with lime juice, so I don't try not to drink this stuff very often because to me if I drink this and I try to have water after like even within a few hours it's like the water tastes like crap. It's 10 o'clock and I didn't eat any more potatoes but I probably should have because somehow I convinced myself that it was okay to eat pistachios and have some tea. <laughs> I actually had a little bit of a headache it's just crazy how used to, like how fast your body can get used to having just a little bit of caffeine um, every day and then when you don't have it, it's like, you know, gives you a headache. I can't imagine what it's like to be a coffee drinker or heavy coffee drinker and having to try to quit. Like that's just crazy. So kudos to you if you've quit or cut down on coffee. <laughs> so. Um, I don't know, I just, I was being stubborn, I didn't want potato, and I know it was just completely, like, emotional or boredom or whatever, it was not true hunger, but, so I don't call this a complete fail, it's, I ate a whole plant food, they don't have oil on them, the only downfall is they have salt, and I still only ate a small amount, so, um, so yeah, there's no point feeling guilty, like if you mess up, you're trying to follow this plan or whatever plan it is and you mess up, feeling guilty does not help move you forward. So um, my next meal is going to be potatoes and keep carrying on. I'm not starting over tomorrow, I didn't ruin this whole thing, it's progress. But anyway, I'm rambling on and I got my contacts out, I'm wearing my new glasses so that I can fall asleep watching TV. I will see you guys possibly tomorrow, I'm not committing just yet to vlogging every day for this, but we'll see. Um, this depends on how busy I am with my graphic design work this week. Don't forget to download your free Potato Reset Jumpstart Guide at thepotatoreset.com. I worked really hard on it for you guys because uh, I get a lot of questions, so this will help answer a lot of your questions. And you'll get a discount when the actual full ebook comes out. So, okay, I'm gonna go for real now. Bye. <laughs> Maybe that's not 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 so. No, they're not. No, no. Uh -huh.